block up to my feet, hurt the slayer, yeah, yeah. better yeah. off work to the good, I'm bad, yeah. yeah. I'm yeah. took a ride in the L, L, man, yeah, I'm took a hold down, where the kill One of the girls, to be honest, Odyssey Sims, she actually trained with my daughter, when my daughter used to play basketball, okay. she played for the, to the wings for a minute. That team, it... As much as I watch them, they they lack a leader on that team. Like the point guard, I forgot her name though. She's she's not bad, but they don't have no enforcer. You know what I'm talking about they don't have nobody to really. Hey, come on, let's get these rebounds, let's get these steals. Nobody really want to play defense on that squad. If they change the attitude as far as what well, again, they need, need somebody who's gonna be like in everybody else's ass. You know right, about? like kind of like Michael Jordan would be. Right. right? They could go far. They they don't have a bad squad, but they just what's the what's the uh, what's the lady uh, what's her name uh, the uh, start with an O, want to be showing out. Uh, Arike. Yeah, Arike. Yeah, Arike. <laughs> yeah, 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 Arike. Man, say so, yeah, that's the guard, right? Uh, oh yeah, Savaline. Yeah, but but Arike, golly boy, yeah. Arike though she, she carrying she's carrying it though. She yeah, she exactly. can't, right. She can't do it by herself. She need that. She need that Pippin and that Coop yeah. coach. You know what I'm saying? She need them ones in that corner. Yeah, you know. And I think we'll have a good turnout. You know what I'm saying? Now the Mavs too. They need to shape up. You know what I'm saying? They need. You know. You know. They doing good. They doing all right. But they need to. They need. They need to get back in shape. Yeah, <laughs> but see, with the Mavs, this is what they did. Right. They they got more defense and more shooting. Right. So that's really another. Another layer to where they going. I mean, right, the, right. They first they got to get through the West. West right. ain't never been easy. Right. Like, like people look at what Boston did. They really didn't face nobody. But you know what I mean, that don't matter now. Right. You got plenty of rest. You know, you you got through your games. You only lost one game mm-hmm. in, the, in the whole playoffs. One game. So right, what right. they tell you? They, no, they got the skills. Yeah. We just need somebody to always that they can they can also control that hole to control that middle that that well, that, we that do. lane. We do, yeah, man. Uh, the problem is they was which I, I don't like this kind of offense. They was right. five out, five right. out. So correct. Like if you if you I mean because we used to play against five out a lot. Mm-hmm. I mean, how do you defend that? It's really hard because if it, it's easy if none of them niggas can shoot. Right. Like if you got one shooter, y'all got to do is kill that one shooter. But every one of them niggas can hit that shot. And oh. if you close out, they're going to move the ball and cut. And that's the same kind of offense I used to run. Right. right. But I, I had I had four out and one in. I had one. I had my best passer in the middle. Right. So if you get the ball and you're cutting, or you, 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 you're screening off, you're going to get the ball. I mean, right. But we need we, we, we do got a ball hog on the team. I ain't gonna say no name. Yeah, he you probably know? from Slovenia, right? Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> you know what I'm saying? Sometimes he he's not Michael. You know what I'm yeah. saying? I understand. I understand the hype. I understand how it go. But you're not Michael, man. You're not Michael, man. <laughs> <laughs> Let me tell you one thing though. I I said the same thing for the first few years he was here. Right. The reason why I said that because it was true, and he had to. Right. You know what I mean, because who else was gonna do it? Right. I mean, even Dirk was giving him the ball at the time. Right. But with Kyrie, now it was like, who wants the ball? You know what I mean? Right. You wanted Kyrie because he now he got somebody to rock with. Right. He know he Kyrie gonna get a bucket. But right. before Kyrie, you had Jalen Brunson. Jalen Brunson get you a bucket, but if you had to choose between Kyrie and Jalen Brunson, who you gonna choose? I'm, I'm, I'm pushing Kyrie. Exactly. You know what I'm saying? Not, not, no, you, you, no I mean, that's no, to, uh, I mean, that's no question. You yeah. know what I'm saying? But you know, yeah. hey, come on now. <laughs> Jalen Brunson can hoop though. I can't. Right. I cannot knock that. Right. That cat got his money. He could hoop. And you know what's funny though? And I'm, I've had a conversation with with I'm gonna say his name Chuck Cooperstein, right? Mm-hmm. He's a, a Mavs. Uh, he's the voice of the Mavs. So he calls the Mavs games on the radio. I text him. I was like, before Bronson, he when he was in free agency, I said, Chuck, I think Bronson is going to go to New York because his daddy's now coaching out there. Right. And he was like, nah, bro. He didn't say it in that words, but he was like, this is not college. He's not going to go to where his daddy is because his daddy's there. I was like, okay. And then what happened? And the one in New York. Exactly. I'm like, bro, it don't matter. And the, and, and the Mavs could have got him for $83 million. Now, $53 million, I believe, in that summer. 
They said, give me some money this summer and I'll stay for that however long the contract is going to be. Man, but, you know, they making moves, you know what I'm saying? They trying to get this casino up in here, you know what I'm saying? You know, they making deals right now. They doing other stuff. They got big stuff going <laughs> on. You know, that center might not be there that long. It might be, you know what I'm saying, put somewhere else behind, you know, some Lusteric or something, you know what I'm saying? <laughs> yeah, you know what the, what the rumor is? Right. It's like, you know where the the old Texas Stadium was? Yep. Is exactly where they may build it at. Because right. they already putting the bridge over there and they're probably going to build a parking <laughs> lot. It's going to have a, probably a theater and all that shit. Yeah, it's a lot of rumors going on. So, we, you know, they, it's I mean, a lot but of... think about it, though. Who just bought the maps? The, the lady from Vegas. Or, yeah, yeah, exactly. But, they but, own casinos in Vegas. But uh, what's the name? Um, he still got a stake in the maps, though. You know what I'm saying? He ain't just give it up. Like, you he know. has, I think, a. Three percent stake now? Is it three percent? I think I'm I could be wrong, but I know it's way low. Ah, Lee. Yeah, he's, he's way out of there. He literally kind of sold the team, to be honest. Oh man. Yeah. I mean, I, I love But you Cuban, know, but we'll see. You know, Mark Cuban, you know, we'll see. We'll see how this goes. We're gonna we're gonna see how this goes, man. I, let's ask you this question. Who's your out of all time maths favorite player? Tyson Chandler. Golly. Okay, who was the all-time uh, three men on Mavs? Uh, statistically, that would be Dirk, but behind him would be Jason Terry. Golly, because I was going to say Finley, Kid, and... Uh... <laughs> <laughs> now, Dirk shot more threes than anybody. Yeah. I think uh, Luke was right behind and him. And Mashburn. Yeah. Well, yeah. Yeah. Ooh, I don't even want to talk about Jam Jamal... <laughs> Jason and Jimmy, man, we actually yeah. did a story on. Well, we didn't do a story on. We was we right. talked about them on the podcast. Yeah, bro. okay, okay. Like, oh, man, nah. it couldn't be Tony Braxton yeah. didn't do that. Man, you don't yeah. remember Tony Dumas? Oh yeah, Tony Dumas. He actually wasn't he dating the girl that was uh, on the radio for the K one O four. I think so. Tony Dumas was cold. Yeah, but man. If he wouldn't have blew out his knee, yeah, golly, man. I think him and and, and, and motherfucking Hardaway. And I'm talking Penny Hardaway. Oh, yeah. That would have been a run for the money. <laughs> they would say him, Dumas, Hardaway, and Jordan. So that time, Hardaway, you got to remember Terrell Sprewell was also hooping too. Oh, man. But Sprewell came a little bit later, though, because, you know, Sprewell came a little bit like with Grant Hill, you know. But see, then that's the era, though. Cause, uh, that you, is the era, yeah, though. That yeah. is the era, yeah. Because I think, what was that? I can't remember the exact year, because I know it was Shaq. It was Shaq, Penny Hardaway, um, Nick Young, and uh, Anderson. Now all of them was just hooping okay. uh, with the Orlando what Magic. You they had a squad. But... I could have walked the way I wanted to go. Man, I love you. Shit, and fucked up my high. Give me a life. A That's some good shit. <laughs> <laughs> Where you get that shit from, Mom? I got it from Columbia, motherfucker.